Hi all, welcome to Trity Technologies, Sada of Fakri and uh, DHTDPS colon slash slash trityllearning.com You can go to this website and you can search for all the courses what we are doing and there are a lot of videos going to come in this uh, uh, port, uh, learning portal and also I'm trying to tie up with people who are willing to join, okay, so who are all willing to put your courses or if you know real time, if you want to contribute anything, you guys can do the contribution and you can sell your courses in my channel for 99 rupees and you can like I'm, I'm giving you 100% of what you get okay so I'm not going to take anything out of your courses if you if you want to build any courses you can build your courses and you can uh, register as an instructor here you can register as an instructor and you can upload your courses let me know if you want to upload your courses you can upload and you can sell your courses okay so if it is uh, below uh, 500 rupees I'll I'll, I'll let if you, if you want to sell it for 500, 499, 399, just let me know. I will uh, sell your courses in my portal so that whatever amount you get, like whatever amount gets, I will give you. Okay, so I'm not going to take anything from that. But if it is above 1000 rupees, there will be something. Okay, so uh, because we need to pay to the uh, gateway. Okay, so if it is above 1000 or above, like above 1000 rupees, or if you are going for 999 or something, okay, so just let me know so that you will get 80% and uh, this portal will get 20%, okay, so if you are interested, okay, so this is all um, about your interest, okay, so if someone wants to put your courses also, you can go and register here so that you can go and upload your courses and you can sell your courses. So that is uh, about writerylearning.com, so I wanted to start something called uh, this is a new concept, okay, so I'm not sure whether it works or not, okay, so uh, I wanted to do something like uh, uh, learn with me, okay, so learn with me in the sense like I wanted to try new things, okay, so what is happening in the market and DevOps is like growing very fastly, lot of people are um, acquiring DevOps and making lot of changes to the environment they are doing entire automation there's no manual stuff nothing manual everything goes in an automation format so how we can do that how we organizations are doing that and uh, how we can design so i want you guys to give all the ideas about this learn with me concept so for example if i want to build something okay so if i want to have my uh, environments like UAT and I want to build my um, dev okay so then I want to build my production okay so if I want to have three pieces of uh, environment how that works okay so first of all I'll uh, just give some brief of what I'm going to do okay so I'll say well, I have one uh, dev environment I have one testing environment and I have one production environment so there will be group of people like you guys can join this okay so learn with me so we can create a, a git okay so where we can create git i'll just give you that uh, so i'll say git uh, tritery technologies so there is something called tritery technologies git already okay so we can go into this git okay so i wanted to create few of the things okay so i wanted to create three environments for this project learn with me project so project name will be learn with me so i will um, try to add all the uh, artifacts here i will try to create new repositories so what exactly i wanted to do okay so first we'll concentrate on git how uh, like we will think as a developer okay so first we'll think as a developer when instead of going into the devops directly we'll think how a developer thinks right? We think like how developer wants to have his environment or how the developing um, teams want their environment okay so we'll talk about git infrastructure first okay so we'll talk more about git of how these are designed in the real time how the organizations are going forward with uh, webhook or github actions or how they are moving towards git labs okay so but basically you should know a basic bit of how it works, how you create a branch, how you create a feature of branch out of it, how you merge it, how you request a pull request, uh, how approvals goes on, okay. So that is the first task, okay. So I wanted to create one task on the development first, okay. So when I'm talking about a task on the development, like I will say 
uh, I will I want to create some tasks here okay so we can go with the jira what okay we, if if this is getting bigger okay so if there are more number of people coming in we can go for the jira as well okay so we can create our jira tickets this is an open source jira will be there okay so with that we can uh, create whatever we wanted to do that okay so here what we can do okay so first of all you need to create a, a branch for development okay so first we'll create a branch for a development so how you need to tag this branch for example if i am creating a branch like what all the things should be there in this um, branch okay so we'll discuss only about branching here okay so for example when i am creating a branch if someone uh, wants to pull this okay so someone wants to get a feature branch out of it okay so for example someone creates a feature branch out of it okay for example this is a feature branch so when you create a feature branch out of it you have done some modifications or whatever you wanted to do you have done so here when we created a branch what we'll do is okay what we'll do is we will uh, create a create a jenkins file okay normal jenkins file okay for for now we'll create a normal jenkins file where um, we can write some logic in that jenkins file how you write that logic we'll see so now we'll create a feature branch out of this for example like i have a develop branch you have created a feature branch out of it you have done some modifications on it and you need to merge this right so you need to merge this onto your Uh, it's better we take uh, this box so that it's easy for us to move right and left okay so see okay it's better okay so now i am taking this feature branch out of dev now what i need to do i need to merge this into the development branch right so whenever you want to merge something onto the development branch from feature branch so what exactly you need to have you need to have a review right someone has to review this approve then merge without approval you cannot merge this branch so this is the logic we need to write okay okay so you know how to do it basically when you are into the git you know this how to do it okay so you are creating a development branch you need to pull something out of this and you need to create a feature branch then you need to merge this feature branch into the development branch but whenever you want to merge something into this development branch you need to review approve and merge like nothing but your teammates like it. someone in your team should do this someone in your team should review someone in your team should approve then someone in your team should like then you can merge that pr into the dev okay so review uh, review and approve will be done by your team members merge will be done by you anyway like you need to merge that into the dev then you will see whether that is working that working or not so here i want to um, append something okay so first this is the use case we'll do it okay so you guys can do it okay you guys can work on it let me know how it works okay so i want to have this in maybe uh if i get a good response if you have already want to send me something out about this uh within uh, two to three hours that will be fine okay so so that in the weekend we can do lot of stuff okay so if you anyone okay so it's not like i want to get hundreds of uh, responses okay any one or two responses also fine i'm i'm fine with the with you guys okay if you want to learn something if you want to get into the real time okay so just do this just send me to just send me the a git link you are git link into my uh, telegram i go and i'll check how it is working okay so then we'll see whether it is working fine or not and how you want how you are going to do this okay so for example i am triggering something from the jenkins okay so remember this you are doing everything from jenkins pipeline only okay so you'll be doing everything from jenkins 
pipeline only. Okay, so you have to do everything from Jenkins pipeline only. So it should trigger like whenever something is happening on your dev branch. Okay, so whenever something is happening, so it will automatically trigger this, right? So the commit will automatically trigger. So I don't want to have this Jenkins to the development. Okay, so create a Jenkins to trig your feature branch first. Okay, so your Jenkins pipeline should trigger feature branch. After that, it will go for your review and approve. Once you create a feature branch, once you edit something, it should go for a review and approve through Jenkins pipeline, and that should be written in Groovy. Okay, go for Groovy. Okay, so this will make you a great like uh, a good um, DevOps engineer. Okay, so. You can survive anywhere and you will have a lot of value. I'm saying you that. Okay, so you can go for bash as well. But if you go with Groovy, if you go with Groovy, if you learn a bit of Groovy, if you learn, if you if you read or uh, if you know how to read Groovy or if you can execute few of the Groovy, okay, even a copy paste of Groovy. Because if you know how to read Groovy, you can do the copy paste of anything. Okay, so that will also work. Okay, so try to write a Groovy pipeline so that it will trigger your feature branch okay so and it will run your build whatever if it might be hello world okay so i don't care what what is what we are doing right now okay so it might just say hello world it will do you a hello world okay so that hello world will trigger through feature branch then you need to get the approval then you need to get the reviewed by your team add few of the team members or your email ids then merge it to the dev Okay, so this is how it should work. You should not do anything on the development branch. Okay, so you should not trigger anything on the development branch because it will, um, like in real time, you don't have that access also. If you are going to a development main branch and if you want to um, tweak something, you cannot do that. Okay, so you have to go through your feature branch, then it has to review approve, then you need to merge that in the development branch. So try to work on this this is just in a one hour or two hours job okay so if you are already into the um, devops if you are already learning devops okay or if you are a developer or if you know git okay so this is like not even one hour job okay so this is a very simple task okay so come up with the answers come just ping me in the telegram guys like when you ping me in the telegram that you have done this I'm going to give you a lot of lot of stuff. Okay, so if you guys are okay to do this, okay, so if you are, um, uh, if you want to learn something out of DevOps or if you want to get a job within three months, okay, let us make a target of three months. Okay, so three months is very good enough. So if you come up with the answers, I am going to give you all this flow, every flow, what happens in the gate, how you do releases and how we uh, push this to the production okay so we'll try to do all that stuff but try to start from here okay so ping me your um, uh, solutions and ping me your uh, git repositories open git repositories because if you are pinging me the git repositories i am going to display it in my channel okay so make it open public okay so so that uh, everyone can see and everyone can learn out of your uh, preparation also Thanks for watching this video. I'll wait after releasing this video. Maybe uh, this will come at 3 o'clock, 11th June today. If you give me responses in 4 or 5 o'clock, then I'll make one more at 6. We'll try to do 3 or 4 tasks per day. Okay. So if it is going on like this, then we, we, we can make a lot of uh, stuff out of Git this week. Okay. So let me, uh, sorry, uh, just send me things, okay? And also I'm going to um, give a Git collaboration overview tomorrow in this channel. So wait for that, okay? So I'll uh, release that video soon, but I wanted to start everything from scratch. So try to get it done. Thanks for watching this video. Hope you um, guys will respond. Have a great day. Have a great weekend. Bye.